Greetings everyone, this is your boy, Bobia 1984 coming to you with some of that Call of Duty Black Ops 2 game play, 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 play. And I'd like to welcome everyone for coming on, uh, I'd like to welcome and thank everyone for coming on back and joining me on my journey as I continue to be the most dominant scrub at Call of Duty Black Ops 2 ever. As you can see, we're playing another round of uh, hard point, hard point here on a uh, standoff. And shout out to my main man at Hood Chemist for providing that nasty music. <laughs> I'm just messing around, y'all. I'm in a great, great mood. I'm in a great mood. I feel great, man. No more migraine headaches, man. I'm feeling like a million bucks today. But um. Let's go ahead and get these. Oh, just got Wesley sniped. Oh, man, I cannot get enough of that. It seems like every game I play, I'm getting Wesley sniped. But uh, let's get these perks and these score streaks, kill streaks, death streaks out the way. For this uh, hard point, I really like using the hard line. Flak jacket is a must. Scavenger is a must. And I'm loving the engineer engineer perk and and the reason I say that uh, flak jack and a scavenger and engineers must for one all these c4s and grenades and all that stuff that's going off I need to be able to survive these bad boys and I'm running scavenger because I'm running a uh, two EMP grenades and I just love picking them up and tossing them and with the engineer uh, perk I can see where all the equipment of the all the enemy's equipment is uh, lined up and s stationed at so I'm, I'm just tossing all my EMP, EMP grenades at them and just get a ton of points for doing that and it just works out perfectly and as you can see I'm running a counter UAV the stealth chopper and orbital VSAT and I, I'm using this because you know I want to be able to help the team out especially when you run with a team of killers that like to get kills if you're using the uh, counter UAV you're gonna get 10 points for each kill that they that they get and then when you finally get to that orbital VSAT you get more points uh, for that so you know, it just depends on who you're running with. If you're running with a team of killers, man, you got to help the team out. Throw up UAVs, counter UAVs, orbital VSATs, and just let them, you know, help help everybody feast. You know, it's not all about you. So, as you can see, uh, I'm just kind of, I guess, camping out the hard point. Just trying to make sure I can hold it down while, you know, everybody else on the other team go get the other points. But, you know, I just, I just seem to enjoy doing it, you know. But... Let's see. It's 90 to 15, and look at that. See, see what I'm saying? I see he threw his bounce belly down. I was able to destroy that and kill him, get my 150 points. So it just works out. But um, just gotta let you guys know, I still have not played Call of Duty Black Ops 2. I don't even remember the last time I played. It's been a long, long while, and. And maybe that's part of the reason why I'm feeling so great. You know, I'm not stressing. I'm not raging like I usually rage. I'm just, you know, I woke up this morning, hopped in the shower, got burned by the shower head like I usually do pretty much every day. And just this morning, it just didn't phase me. It's like, well, oh, well, you know, oh, well, I still felt great. You know, I didn't trip over any of my son's toys like I usually do when I stumble around in the morning. I just... I was just floating. I feel like I was just walking on water this morning, you know. I feel good. My body feel good. I got my workout in. I got Wesley sniped again, but it just doesn't phase me, you know. It just does not phase me. But I'm feeling so good that I'm actually, I actually think I'm gonna hop on the game and play and, pl and play some of this Rage Quit. Was it Rage Quit? Rage Quit Ops 2? Because <laughs> I call Modern Warfare 3 Rage Quit 3. I haven't really decided what to call this one yet, but I think I'm gonna hop on. And, and, and play and just <clears throat> I'm gonna try to keep that mind frame that's just a game and I'm not gonna let it bother me and I'm not gonna rage out like I usually do you know but man oh man oh man this weekend I had a blast man I, uh, me and my wife went out of town to uh, one of her relatives wedding we were actually in the wedding I was a groomsman she was a bridesmaid and for the longest time I didn't want to go to this wedding because you know how well, not everybody's married, but you know, most times your wife or your girlfriend just sign you up for something that you didn't want, that you didn't necessarily have a say in. She just signed me up as a groomsman, groomsman for this, and I was like, "What you mean? I'm I'm in the wedding? I don't even, you know, in the in the because it's her female cousin. She's the bride, and he's, she's marrying, you know, her long time, I don't know, boyfriend or whatever he was, and." I don't really know him that well, you know, so I was like, how you gonna just put me in his wedding? I said, I don't know him, he don't know me, but, you know, after weeks and weeks of, you know, saying I wasn't going, I ended up, 
<laughs> you know, getting fitted for my tux and going and actually had a great time. You know, we went out there Friday and uh, that night, Friday night, I went out with him and his, you know, his brother and a couple of his friends. We went out to Deja Vu and I'm not going to lie, man, I really didn't want to go because, you know, I didn't know them. But, you know, hey, I was going to Deja Vu. I was going to have a good time for him and I actually upgraded and I went from making it mist to making it drizzle you know I got in there you know got a few drinks and was having a good time you know and got to know my man a lot better and things got a little wild and out of hand and I know this is PG-13 I can't really you know <laughs> dive into the topic you know of what happened but you know just you know things got a little out of hand you know something like out of a hangover movie you know we 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 were having a lot of fun that night so I'm just gonna say that you know cause my old lady don't really know the whole story so you know, I'm just going to keep it as is. But we had a lot of fun. Ended up waking up at a house. Don't know where I was at. You know, just woke up at somebody's house. And I was like, oh, okay. Oh, well, I kind of want to stay at the hotel. I paid for it. But, you know, woke up the next morning, you know, went and got dressed. And, did, you know, went to the wedding ceremony. Everything was fabulous. Everything went well. And I was happy for him. And I was happy for my, you know, my wife's cousin. And had a great time. And maybe that's just part of the reason, you know, I'm feeling so great. You know, I had a good time at Deja Vu. I had a great time at the wed. I just, just, just feels great, you know. And usually when I feel great in the morning, uh, <laughs> I don't know why, but a lot of times things just go wrong and it, things just have not gone wrong for me yet. And I'm enjoying it. And I know I'm going to go home and watch a little TV, probably hop on the game, well, I'll probably watch some NBA basketball first and eat dinner and call it a night. You know, and, and just be happy with it. But as you can see, you saw I was kind of camping around most of the hard point, doing my thing, trying to help the team out, calling the counter UAVs, calling in my stealth chopper, calling the orbital V set, throwing the EMP grenades all over the place, and it just worked out for me, you know. But as you can see, it's 223 to 81. We kind of came, we saw, and we conquered this this team. And and as I say, you know, when I get back on and start playing some more you know maybe we we'll start getting some better competition but got my got my sign off music coming on wish they could play this for me at the club man let me just come in there let me just start making it drizzle and just just play this for me you know what i'm saying just 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 tossing up the dollars but hopefully you enjoyed this gameplay hopefully you enjoyed everything man come on back next wednesday 12 15 your boy bobby are gonna be here follow me on twitter at bobby 1984 but we gotta get up out of here let me see 37 and 7 in man. I enjoyed that. Nice gotta say we go, 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 go.